I learned um, that you had some time with Miles Garrett um, working out and stuff. How did that all come together, and, and what was that like? Yeah, um, actually, I was up here, I would say, I think three – no, it was about a month before training camp started. Just wanted to come up and see the area and get used to it and ended up staying and, and finding a place in Strongsville to work out at uh, NST Sports Performance and was there for five weeks training and, like – Later on, it was like three or four weeks in. Miles, um, actually, one of his like good friends was started training there. That's like a he's a basketball player, and then uh, Miles actually started coming in every now and then and working out. So got to work out with him a few times, and he's he's a great dude, and he's uh he he tries to teach me stuff, and you know just being out there and seeing how he worked that first day, I was like, all right, it's it's time to go, and you know obviously he's one of the the best players in the league, so it was pretty cool to build that relationship and. And just be able to um, just just see how he works and see really how talented he is. You know, you got to be like, wow, if I'm, I'm having to block that, I got to get ready to go. So it was pretty cool. So, like, how eye-opening is it when you see him train? I mean, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I, I, mean guy, right? I mean, yeah. first, what, first of all, he was the first overall pick. Yeah. He's, he's humongous. He, he's just a freak. So, I mean, it was pretty cool to see how he trained and, you know, just do some of the stuff he was doing. It, it was cool. Uh, any advice that sticks with you about just transitioning to the NFL that he, that he dropped on you? Really just just come in and work. Um, you know, there's going to be good days and bad days. Uh, the biggest thing for him was, like, when we were out there, it was all work, and then when we're done, we talk. So really just come in and work and keep your head down and do your thing. So how often do you think you guys were – we're working out together for those couple of weeks. Was it was it a repeated session? Um, I mean, it was on. I think we it was either one or two times because I actually uh, ended up going out of town for like a few days before training camp started. So it was only one, it was either one or two times. It wasn't many times. Okay. And then Jared Pell, Pelly is the is the uh, yeah he's the guy that we were training with. Yep. Okay. And and what 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 was he like to work with? Because I he's from here and he's he's got yeah. It was. I mean. Uh, you know, I really didn't know where I was going to work out and just started Googling stuff on the way up here. And um, his ne their place popped up. It was open. And, you know, I gave him a call and went in. And it was really great. Uh, really good five weeks of training. Uh, you know, a lot of, like, explosive movements. And then uh, Devin Jordan, he was uh, – he's actually the receivers coach at Akron now. He, um, he, came, to, he came up and – once a week and work with me on routes and stuff. And I mean, it, it was just a complete package and it really helped me out a lot and get prepared.